Anyway, I, as I was going through it and putting stuff in here, I discovered some things that I just, I completely forgotten about. Like, for instance, check this cool thing out. I've never even used it. Bought it, but never even used it. I bought this is because the other reservoir that we have are square. Well, they're more like a hexagon. Those are out in the garage. Let's see if I can get this out without damaging anything. So, there you go. So on the back it has this metal thing right here that runs off to a plug. Of course it has RGB and it can sensor the flow speed and all that stuff. It's pretty. I spent a lot of money on this. But anyway, and of course it comes with, you know, the fittings and everything that you need. Moving on, I found some really old stick of DDR4 Elite. Check these out. 4 gig sticks, DDR4 Elite. Wow, 3200. And then I dug these out. DDR4 with uh, RGB jackets on, y'all remember those. And I think I actually have... Yeah, another set. So I have two of these. That's right, it was 64 gigs. Both of my dogs are chilling, chilling. You guys already know about this, right? The Razer Kishi. I did a video on that about a month ago. Haven't seen that. Might want to check that video out. And then if you open it, see? It holds a hard drive perfectly inside of it. And it will keep it protected. You can ride on it, what type of drive it is. You know? It even comes with a, a little handle. So after you latch it together, if you want to carry it, you could. But yeah, I bought that a long time ago for like 10 bucks. I thought that was kind of cool. This is interesting. This right here, guys, is, I believe, a mirrored system block. It doesn't say. Anyway, it's a flow block. It's just a transfer block. I believe I used this in one of the builds before. I don't remember. Or maybe it was the other one that we used. But I have all kinds of little things like this. And I bought more stuff coming. We have water blocks and GPU blocks. Let's see here. What's in this box? Freeze mod. Hmm. Oh, this is interesting. There's something in there. Let's see here. It comes with a bracket. So there's some kind of black aluminum bracket. See, it's how long it's been since I've opened any of this stuff. I just don't remember what any of it is. What? What is this? Aluminum with the top on it. It's like a transfer case or something. Like you could have two going into one or one coming out of two. See that? I don't know why I bought this. Maybe it's a housing for a D5. No, 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 no. No, it's just an aluminum water block with an acrylic top to it it's interesting i don't know or remember why i bought that but all right i guess now this has never been opened or never been used you might say i mean it's a it's a brand new radiator if i remember correctly because i believe that this one is branded it's an actual freeze mod branded See, there's the holes at the top there. Let's see if I can open it. See how it says freeze mod right there on it? This is a very nice radiator, man. I've had this thing for years. Good quality radiator. I just, I've never used it for anything. Who knows, I might freeze mod. That's cool. And then actually, if I think about it, there is a Hold on, this is also freeze mod, we'll get to that. I think there's a 120 milliliter version. I believe that's what's in this. Let's see here. Yeah, 120 millimeter version. Cause it's two says freeze mod on it. 
That's cool. I didn't know I had two of them. That's what I'm saying. That's why I had to go back through here. I wanted to look at all this stuff. But this, if you have it, is a freeze mod. See, you can see it says it right there at the bottom. Freeze mod. And then it's branded freeze mod. It's a little dirty, but what can you expect? Yeah, it's reservoir pump combo. They sell these things for like 80 bucks on eBay. Oh, it even says it at the top there. Freeze mod. Never used it. It does work though. I would like to use that eventually. Maybe we can use it in an upcoming build. I don't know. I bought a new PC case, which I'm going to do a video on here real soon that you guys will like. Let's see here. What's in this? Oh, cool. So this is probably a a transfer block or something again oh yeah so what this is this actually goes to a ram this is supposed to sit on top of your ram and cool your ram um, but I believe we used it for a transfer block water goes in and then comes out at a higher level works good has RGB in it you can see the RGB right there in it. That's cool. Man, some of this stuff I've just, I've like 100% forgotten. What is this? It's a for crap. What's in here? Oh, just a bracket. Ah, that's right. There's just a bracket in here. Yep, just a bracket. So you can mount a pump this way or that way or whichever way you need to mount it. I thought that, that would come in handy since I do a lot of DIY projects see here oh wow I know you guys remember this thing right check that out so it goes underneath it's like a top plate for your computer lights up RGB and stuff I forgot I had that too jeez what a walk down to memory lane and then those are my uh, RGB diamond strips and then MSI RGB and then this this right here this little container is just packed full of just all kinds of RGB stuff specific RGB stuff you know I mean it's it's just full of it it's for water blocks and CPU blocks and you know, look there's some bracket stuff right there um, like for instance this this is a spare RGB light to one of my um, GPU water blocks and then looks like we got like some reservoir clips you know so it's just a box dedicated to um, water cooling that's, that's all that's in here it's dedicated to the RGB part of water cooling um, alright so I have made one heck of a mess I'm gonna clean it all up now but anyway I thought I would show you guys this I thought that maybe y'all would like to see all this stuff it's kind of cool right it's like a walk down through memory lane but all of this stuff is going to get repackaged put out in the garage in the garage is where it's going to go anyway all right guys i'm getting out of here thank you for watching i appreciate you guys you guys be cool